Good evening, I'm Lindsay Wright. An animal welfare group has requested that a judge toss an emergency rule recently approved by Indiana's Wildlife Agency that allows rifle hunting on state or federal property. The Indiana Department of Natural Resources issued that rule November 3rd as a way to fix what was described as a legislative mistake earlier this year that banned rifles in public forests. The ethics group argues that the ban is a clear legislative mandate, but a department spokesman says the agency believes it took appropriate action. Indiana Republican Representative Luke Messer is running for Senate in Indiana, though he primarily lives with his family in Washington, D.C. It's not the first time a politician has lived outside the state, but it could complicate Messer's plans to win the Republican primary and unseat Democratic Senator Joe Donnelly next year. Some towering political figures have been toppled in recent years after struggling to explain whether they live in the state. Messer's chief rival, Representative Todd Rokita, has already sought to make residency a major campaign issue. The Hoosier unemployment rate rose 0.1 percent in October to 3.9 percent. It's the highest level since March and the first time in six years the number has gone up four months in a row. The state's private sector did add jobs for the second consecutive month, 2,500 in October. But more than 14,000 more Hoosiers overall were unemployed last month than in September. As a result, the state's labor force declined for the first time in three months. Now for a quick look at the forecast tonight, chances of showers, possible thunderstorms, a low of 48 degrees. Taking a look into the five-day forecast, showers to start off the weekend, a high of 62 tomorrow, mostly sunny skies on Sunday, high of 37, sunny skies on Monday through Wednesday. More news is online at WTIUnews.org.